General Grievous had one of the most wild design evolutions in the Star Wars prequels, and that's largely because George Lucas did the smart thing and trusted his artists. When Grievous was conceptualized, Lucas said he could be an alien, he could be a droid, he just had to look evil. The Revenge of the Sith art book shows us how many different forms that could take, with one artist saying, all we knew is he had to be dark and he had to be evil. Some of these designs look cool, some of them I'm very happy didn't make it, like this little dude in a hover chair with two droid guards. And one thing that is interesting is how much attention was also given to the Magna Guards. They seem to be almost as important as Grievous himself. Eventually, Lucas signed off on a general head and body shape, and the design becomes a lot closer to what we would see in the movie. I've got to say, though, this variant of Grievous has got to be my favorite. I love the cleaner, more slim design. He looks even deadlier in my opinion, and it's definitely a callback as the art book references to Vader and his stormtroopers, albeit with a bit of a reversal on the Grievous side. This version of the character is definitely more similar to what we got in the Clone Wars shorts, which were actually released, for those who don't remember, before episode three came out. In fact, he would first appear a full year before the movie's release, which I think is pretty cool. Anyway, did one of these concept art Grievouses catch your imagination? I like this one, kind of looks like an Inquisitor, but let me know your thoughts and more, of course, down below.